Come here. Why did the Dwarf King want this armor so badly? What's so special about it? There are many legends behind the Dave Grath Eker. A suspicious amount of legends, which makes confirming anything about this particular armor difficult. But the one constant among them is the ability of the armor to offer ultimate protection. A useful attribute for an unpopular king, you see. Yet this plagued land is all that remains of him. This is why you do not trust legends, boy. Well, what can you trust? Yourself, your eyes, your instincts. Blind trust in a legend is a gamble, and rarely does it pay off. If you say so. Yes, sir. Atreus, to me. Okay, I'm coming. Still won't open? Looks like we need three. Here we go! Get a 
enemies are strong here. Your guard out. Ruin, I guess. Maybe the throne room's in better shape. Another one here. Starcather. Wow. That's a lot of arms. That's fair to say. Six? Seven? Eight? Could he shoot four bows at once? More of a swordsman. He did only have the two eyes. It looks like Thor cut him down to size. It's what he does. Do you hear that? No. What do you hear, boy? Crying. And screams. Large crowd of people. Ah, uh, just old spirits, I suppose. They're getting louder. They sound almost like... Hello! There's a passage behind this throne. A secret passage! Well, wouldn't be a proper throne room without a secret passage. Here. 
Interesting. I may want to write that down. The things you pulled from him. Those must be the three mythical ingredients Brock was talking about. I can say with utmost certainty that I've never laid eye on a stranger set of objects in my life. How are Brock and Sindri supposed to build with... whatever they are? Don't count the dwarves out, lad. They're right pricks, but they're resourceful. They once made an unbreakable chain out of little more than a cat's footstep and bird spit. That doesn't even make sense. Well, that's the legend. If you wanted sense, you shouldn't be talking to a severed head. 